Hey there, thank you for being here. As always, I'm Adria from KajabiExperts.com. Yesterday was a really, really, really amazing day. The guys from Kajabi just released something that we've been several months waiting for. So they released two things. Yes, two big things at the same time. They released the landing pages and they released the forms. They are somehow connected. So you will see how one connects to each other. I spent all night working. I spent like all night updating my email integrations, updating my themes and making sure that everything is ready to be 100% comp compatible with the landing pages and with the forms. You can always take a look at www.kajabiexperts.com to see all the services I offer. All of them are ready for the landing pages and ready for the forms. Then after working several hours doing that and gaining expertise from that, I went ahead, I slept like two or three hours, not more, and I woke up and here I am creating some videos to show you how amazing the landing pages and the forms are. Let's start first with the landing pages. If you're seeing this video, the correct order is landing pages and then forms. If you, if you have seen the forms video before, then what can I do? Now this time is for you to for the landing pages. So let's go ahead and let's see how to use the landing pages inside Kajabi. Remember that all of this that you will see in this video is as the current date. So things may change. This is a beta and things may change for the final release. Let's see how we can do landing pages inside Kajabi. I'm inside the marketing option and we have two things we have the landing pages and we have the forms we're gonna see in this video how the landing pages works so as you see i don't have any landing page yet but i can go here and create a new landing page what is a new landing page a landing page it can serve for different purposes the main one is to be our home for our Kajabi site. So right now uh, you know that in the, the home page of your Kajabi site is gonna be your store. So you're gonna see your products there. But now with the landing pages, we can change that. So we can create a landing page that will serve as our home page for our Kajabi site. That's the one of the uses of the landing pages. We'll see later how we can do this. Another use for a landing page can be to use as a product page, so as a sales page. So if you have, if you are selling something, a course, a product, a podcast, whatever, <clears throat> and you don't want to use the sales pages of Kajabi, you can use one of the landing pages. We will see also how to do that, how we can change to make the landing page to be our sales page. Another use of the landing pages is to use them just as they are. So just as landing pages. So you can create as many landing pages as you want and you can direct people to the landing pages. So you can put them in the menu or have them shared via email or some, or however you want to get uh, people to see them. We're gonna see also how we can do that. So let's go first creating our landing page. As I said, I clicked, uh, I'm gonna go back. I click here on new landing page. And here you see several themes. There are a lot of themes and um, they are for different purposes. They are all customizable and <clears throat> you can, uh, well, you can add more and there will be even more. I even made one from uh, that is the coming soon page that you might already know it uh, and you will see how you can install it also later in the video. So let's say we choose, I don't know, this one, for example, the citrus. When you create, when you click on it, it asks you to add a title. You can change that later. So I'm gonna say, test landing page but you we can change it later I'm gonna click save so now the landing page is being installed in Kajabi here we have it here we have 
the our landing page. It has some some customizable uh, things that you can change here. I'm not gonna go on into detail, but there are different stuff. Here you have the form where you can add a opt-in form, but I'm gonna cover this in a separate video. So I'm gonna cover the forms in a separate video. And once this is done, well, you can preview it here. You can click. You see landing pages is something separate from your site. So although I have the Kajabi Expert site that has a theme and has some colors, some things, it doesn't share the styling with my landing pages. So you'd have to take that into consideration. The landing pages don't share same styling as your page. If you want to do that, you will need to manually style it and manually change that. So once we've, we are done customizing the landing page, we hit done <clears throat> and we hit, and we see that it's created here. Uh, now we can go to edit and here we can change the title. As I said, it can be changed. We can change the URL. So by default, Kajabi creates a URL for us. But if we want to change it, we can change it here. This will be how users will access to the page. That was the thing that I was saying if you are sharing this landing page. So for example, if you are using an email marketing tool to share uh, this page, you should use this URL. Basically, it's your domain. So in my case, kajabiexperts.com slash p slash an uh, a URL that you can customize. Then we have with some SEO and sharing, you can leave that empty and uh, Kajabi will use the default or you can fill this data. And that's it for the landing page creator creation. Again, we can always customize the look and feel from the customize and we can go to edit to change this. Okay, now we have this landing page. I have it here. How we make this landing page our homepage? It's really easy. So we're gonna go to settings inside our Kajabi site and we're going to change here where it says homepage. We're going, instead of show the store, that is the default, we're gonna say show a landing page and we're gonna select which landing page we want to use. By doing that, we're gonna put the landing page that we choose as our default homepage. So we're gonna select it here and we're gonna save. I'm not gonna do it because I don't want to change my homepage, but you get the idea. This will make the homepage of your site to be the landing page. So wherever I, whenever someone enters, for example, in my case, kajabiexperts.com, they would see this landing page instead of the store. Okay, let's see now how we can do the same, but for a sales page, because I said that you can create a landing page that can work out as a sales page. We're going to go to sales. We're going to go to sales pages and we have to choose which sales pages we want to replace. So. For this example, I'm going to use this one to test how to play video. And we're going to go down until we see the rider redirect. Here we can choose a landing page to use. As you see right now, it's no redirect and we can change to test landing page. So basically, if I save now, when people go to these sales pages inside my store, so when they are inside the store and they go to these sales pages or by using the URL, if they go with this URL to these sales pages, they're going to see the landing page. So as it says here, this is great for closing a cart or using a custom sales page. So imagine that you're selling a product and for some reason you want to close the car because it was a limited time offer or whatever. So you can always redirect to a landing page that, for example, has an opt-in form. So you can collect 
the data. Okay, we will we would click save and this will change our sales page to be this landing page. The last way to access your landing page, and we're gonna see now how we can do that, is to add them to the menu. So for example, uh, I have this, I'm gonna access it directly. We said it's the domain name, so kajabiexpress.com slash p slash it was test landing page, I think. Exactly. So this is the URL for my landing page. So if we want to add it now to the menu, we're going to go to the website. Navigation. And inside here, we're going to add a link and we're going to say it goes to a link. So right now there's no way to add it directly. So we don't have the the landing pages there. I don't know if they will add that in the future, but for now, there's the only way to do that. So we, in this case, I'm, go, I'm gonna say test page, whatever name you want, and then the path or the URL that it can be the full URL like this, or you can just say, oops, or you can just say slash P slash test landing page. We're gonna hit save and this is gonna appear in our menu here or in the future menu or in any other menu that you have because you know you can have different link lists. So depending on where you add it, it will appear in your theme. The last thing is just, as I said, by sharing this URL. So you can just share this URL in your emails, in the social media, wherever you want, and people will see this landing page. Let's see now the last part, and it's installing a new landing page. So if you uh, get a designer to create a landing page for you, or you hire someone to do it for you, or you do it by yourself, or you buy one of my landing pages, as I have right now, I have one to sell, but there will be more in the future. I'm going to show you how you can install it, how you can install the new landing page. So basically, you're going to go here again, marketing, landing pages, and we're going to go to upload theme. Here, you have to drag the landing page that you bought. So in my case, this is the coming soon. I'm just going to drag it or select it from your computer. I like more the dragging and it's going to be uploaded. It's exactly the same as installing the landing page, but you're in this case, you're uploading it here. We're going to customize the landing page. So again, we have the customization stuff for our landing page. And once we are done, we can click here and we have it installed. Now what we need to do is to customize, to go to edit and we're going to change the title and the URL. And that would be it. that way we could install landing pages, new landing pages. As always, if you want to, if you have already, uh, this works exactly the same as the theme. So if you have already landing page that you want to duplicate, you're going to just go to more export zip and you're going to receive an email from Kajabi. That in that email that will contain a link, you can click the link, download the landing page, and then upload theme. Let's see if they change the naming because it's not really theme, it should be the upload landing page, and choose the zip that you just download. This way you're gonna duplicate your landing page. I think I explained pretty much of it, of all of it. As I said before, this is the current state of landing pages and some of the stuff can change in the future.